Well, the next section then he wants us to understand here is divine compassion and the eradication of suffering, right? He says, uh, so keeping this in mind, this all this idea of God is different from us, and yet he uh, you know, has affections and that sort of thing. He doesn't respond, but he does have these various affections. He says, keeping this stuff in mind, we must see the importance then of properly construing God's love. It is simply not true that for God to love and sympathize with his creatures, notice, he must necessarily suffer as they do. Suffering is not a constitutive uh, element of love, right? right? So in order for him to identify, he doesn't have to suffer, right? God may express deep compassion, he tells us, for those who suffer without suffering and hurt uh, himself. This is a great source of comfort. Notice the sick do not need another sick person, but a powerful and loving healer, right? So, yes, a person uh, can sympathize and have compassion uh, over a sick person, but they don't have to be sick themselves, right. right? So if God were of such a nature that he suffered when his creatures suffered, think about that. Every time a creature suffered, God had to suffer. Then he would be the most uh, to be pitied, right? <laughs> right. is what Christensen tells us. Right. His omniscience and love would taste the bitter poison of every tragedy in history. Uh, the majestic God, he says, would be dethroned in misery. Right. right? And, and we might think that suffering is kind of this necessary quality for love because Oh, you know, it's it's uh, it's our ideas of uh, oh, uh, if you get married, you're you're you, you uh, say goodbye to your time and money, the old ball and chain. <laughs> um, you know, if if uh, we read our stories about love, it's always uh, you know the the liar revealed. Uh, Aladdin has to be Prince Ali in order for him to get Jasmine, but then uh, you know he he he's revealed as the 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 um <laughs> the. the guy out in the street um, or it's it's the uh, the man who, who uh, and women who are separated because of some kismatic uh, serendipitous uh, uh, tra tragedy of events a tragedy of comedy um, and and so kind of from our um, our desire to dramatize uh, uh, love uh, I think that's where our idea kind of of, of suffering in love and 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 I think when we speak like that too, uh, oh, you know, uh, it, it's important for Jesus to suffer because um, he can he can love us better, or, or, or he he he's able to relate to us, and and therefore we can we can relate better to 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 him. It 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 it, it seems like um, our explanations, while they that might be helpful and and truthful in some capacity, as we'll get into a little bit later, um, I think that's where kind of the 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 mix up tends to to happen there. Mm -hmm.